Anderson, your team scored a playoff win. What are your thoughts after this emotional win for your team? This is definitely a huge win. Uh, it was a very tough game that we have to fight until the end. And uh, I feel very happy for our team. How do you think the team's doing in terms of just responding to adversity? Like you, you all had a, a moment in the game where things weren't going your way, but you were able to, you know, Forget it and just rally back. How do you think your team is doing, like mentally, right now? Um, yeah, like you said, we had those down, those uh, downs, but uh, it's all part of this game. So we have to keep playing, keep going, and uh, keep fighting on, until the end. I feel like our team is doing good in that part because after the, they scored the second goal, we come, we came together and then we uh, realized that we were not doing good so we came back we put the second one in and then we put the winning goal and that's game basically when you scored your goal at the end just what was going through your your mind when you that moment talk about that moment for us <clears throat> yeah sure um, it was it was amazing just uh, wa uh, watching the ball going into the back of the net was just amazing. Uh, I, I, I've i been actually thinking about this game since like two or f three weeks. So this was a dream goal for me. Thank you. So when you're thinking about this goal weeks ago, just did it go the way you imagined it? It passed my expectations. It, I, I've noticed just watching you, it seems like you're as the season's gone on and you're a sophomore now, you seem like you're really focused more so than ever on just like lifting people up. Like, you know, if somebody has a mistake, you're the first person to put your arm around them. Talk about just being a leader in that way, like an emotional leader on the team. Yeah, I, um, after last year, Bryce was the only captain. So this year we realized that someone else had to uh, actually take that role so uh, Alex Andrew and myself we are trying to do our best to do that and uh, it's the, uh, the way it's supposed to be we have to be there for others when they miss they are they gotta be there for me when I miss so it's it's all good how do you think your team's doing in terms of staying together and being there for each other just what do you like about your teammates right now I honestly like it that we are becoming more like a family. We are a family already because when we started this season, there was like groups and, you know, it was like these players were not uh, doing great with uh, other players. So, but by, by now we are all like a family and we're trying to get this championship as a, as a team. Alex, you scored a goal today. What was rushing through you when you scored that playoff goal? I mean, just being able to tie the game, it felt good knowing that we were back in the game after being down, and they scored two goals right away, so I was just able to tie back the game back up. What does a win like this say about your team where things aren't going your way for a time period, but you're able to persevere and grind out the result? Uh, every time they, they scored, we made sure we huddled up. And we just we just told like we just told each other like straight up like we need to fix this so we can win because we don't want this to be our last game. How do you feel about the way the team's the concentration of the team right now? Do you think that's something that could be improved, or what do you think is going to have to happen between now and the championship game to to win another title? Uh, especially coming into this game, uh, concentration was a big part because we didn't have a game in two weeks. So this was the first game in two weeks that we actually played, so we had to make sure we were actually concentrated. But now that we may have, we may play tomorrow or the following day, we should we we'll probably be good in concentration. How do you think you and your teammates are doing with just the pressure of the playoffs and there's really no, there's no safety net if you lose, your season's over. How do you think you're handling it? Uh, I think we're doing it pretty well. We're able to keep our heads with the crowd and against their their bench. Their bench was very excited against 
talking a lot against us, so we're being able to push through it. What would it mean to you, or what is it going to mean to you on uh, the Region 20 title game? Chance to win your second season, you're a sophomore. What would that mean to you to win the titles in each of your seasons here at Howard? Oh, I feel pretty good being able to do it my second time and the school's third time in a row. It would just be a, mean a lot, especially for the incoming freshmen. They'll be able to feel good about winning the first region.